as a result of the changes. Now to the first in our series of seven flashbacks where we take a look at some of Sydney's history-making moments. In 1968, Oxford Street was brought to a standstill by a fire in the department store Buckingham's. It was the most spectacular blaze the city's ever seen, and it was a cameraman's dream. Here is a special news flash from our newsroom at the Sydney Morning Herald. Anzac Day 1968, the old Buckingham's department store in Oxford Street. For a while it appeared as though the whole city block would be engulfed. A fire firemen still talk about. It was Terry Lavery's first. He was 19. The wall came down in front of me. I, I uh, have never forgot it. Firemen scattered as the masonry and flaming debris plunged into the roadway. A Channel 7 news team was right on the spot to record the drama. Well, the whole thing just came down in one huge bolt. You know, it just went bang. That moment, one of Australia's best news photographs. People say, oh, you're the guy that took that fire picture. Yeah, I remember that. Russell McFedron worked for the Sydney Sun. As a press photographer, you know, you only get these chances like sort of once in a lifetime. Buckingham's had been grand, but was being demolished when the fire started. 38 years ago, Buckingham's was that whole city block, shops and apartments now. This is me here on the, on the left-hand side holding the branch. Noel Sweatman's retired, but he was there and he's got the photos too, at home. So many old firemen do. Uh, and as soon as it started to go, everyone sung out, here she goes, and we took off. And I reckon I was first up in Oxford Street. <laughs> Another big fire is tonight burning in the city. Sydney's had worse. No one was lost at Buckingham's. But it's the fire so many remember. Paul Marshall, 7 News. The man who